beast in a gruesome struggle for territory. Uh, excuse me, I was sunbathing here. Um, and have you seen my plump, slow-moving cousin? <laughs> but nearby, there is another kind of struggle. Man versus Apes Recycled Potluck Mystery Meal. <laughs> uh, George thinks he solved the mystery. George, don't play with your food. Or a... Did you wipe your feet 2,000 times before you came inside? No. Well, go, go! Ape, that's gonna take him an hour. He'll miss this delicious dinner. Oh, it's the only way I can have a little time away from George. 531, 532. I need a little personal space. So, I was gonna ask you guys. Oh my gosh, I think he needs to talk about his feelings. Yay! Okay, Mr. Keep It All Locked Up Inside Guy, let it out. Tell us your feelings. Uh, I was just gonna ask you to help me tie him up and leave him in a cave. Only for a month or so. I think you're being a little dramatic. Oh, no, I'm not. He shows up everywhere I am. Everywhere. When I'm reading... What are George and Ape reading? When I'm slurping... George brought his own straw! <laughs> when I'm bathing... <laughs> Two thousand! Whew! My feet hurt. Hello, sneaky stranger! Well, how did you see me? George notices everything in the jungle. <laughs> I'm Jungle Joel. Perhaps you've heard of my restaurant chain. <laughs> Planet Junglewood. Yeah, I just opened one in the jungle. We're famous for our collection of jungle collectibles. Knickknacks, doodads, and authentic forest memorabilia. Does Bud look clean to you? <laughs> Say, I could use a strong, unsuspecting fellow like you to carry things for me. But George spends every second of the day with his best friend, Ape. <laughs> well, if you change your mind, call me. Joel? <laughs> you have to tell George right out. Even best friends need time alone. He's a big guy. He can take it. <laughs> I guess girl time didn't work. And all those times when George asked what Ape was doing and you said... You were asleep. I'm sorry, George. Sometimes I just need some space. Maybe you should spend some time with other people, too. Okay? Okay. Meanwhile, Joel got busy doing what he does best. Hmm? Hmm? I leave for one second and the house is gone. <laughs> what is it? Did something valuable go inexplicably missing? Ape says George needs other friends. Will Jungle Joel be George's other friend? Why, of course. And I'm sure you want to get back at him by betraying him in some horrible way. No. Ape's still George's best friend. Oh. Just a best friend who doesn't want George putting on his deodorant for him. Tell me, new friend, has this ape ever spoken of an ancient wooden box deep in the jungle with a stone banana on its door that none should ever touch? And where it is? Yep. Since we're friends, maybe you could take me there. Okay. Follow George. Magnolia, we have a reservation at Planet Junglewood. What's the scene there? Is it dressy, non-dressy, or non-dressy dressy? Well, you've got on, it's fine. This is a bath towel. Ooh, but with the right purse. Oh, here it is, the cursed box no one should ever even touch. 
Finally, people will come from all four corners of the world for a chance to not touch this box. <laughs> I bet you a peanut you're not strong enough to lift it. Ha! George can lift anything. <laughs> bet you another peanut you're not strong enough to carry it all the way to my restaurant. <laughs> Boy, some people should not bet. <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> Something terrible's happened. <gasps> they ran out of loaded potato skins? King Shake of Fist's most cursed relic is missing. King who's what? Long ago, King Shake of Fist ruled the apes. Have you brought me treasures out of respect for my power? Uh, no, actually, I just wanted to use the bathroom. He had the only bathroom in the jungle and became furious as more of his subjects visited him just to use the facilities. Come you to exalt me with praise? Uh, yes, yeah, sure, your hair looks great. Which way to the bathroom? <laughs> so he cursed the bathroom. If it was ever touched by a hand other than his, all apes would be flushed from the jungle forever. Someone has stolen it, and the apes are being flushed away. Well, go get George! Oh, sure. Get away from me. Find new friends. And, oh, by the way, I need this huge favor. What's worse, saying you're sorry or getting flushed by a cursed potty? Hmm. What was my first choice again? <laughs> Uh, why the wait? I don't want to get flushed. Oh, of course. <laughs> it's a question. Listen, I'm sorry if I hurt your feelings earlier, but someone stole King Shake of sacred bathroom, and his ancient curse is flushing all the apes from the jungle. What does this bathroom look like? Uh, a rectangular box, about the size of that thing on your shoulder. We don't even know where to look. It's mine! Mine! <laughs> wait! <gasps> look out! Ladies and gentlemen, the most special relic we've ever featured, the ancient bathroom of the Eighth King! <laughs> Please, if that was really the cursed bathroom, those apes over there would be... <laughs> <laughs> he must be in there, along with everything else he's stolen. Stolen? He probably stole all those jungle knickknacks, just like he stole the king's bathroom. In that case... <laughs> what was that? It means, hey, everybody, come get all your stuff! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Sorry, I don't have anything until eight o'clock. I don't think our brown explosion's coming. My precious jungle chutzkies, my knickknacks, my goo guys, my bathroom. No! Oh, my bathroom is okay. I'm not ruined. Uh, George, I bet you a peanut you can't help me run away with this so I can come back and do the same thing all over again. Joel won't get away with this. Why? Because you and your former best friend, Ape, say so? Oh, ooh, ooh, ah, I'm Ape, and I just want to be alone, away from George, because he's so annoying. Ooh, 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 ah. Oh, I'm ape! Ooh, ooh, ah! ah wait, I, I'm not an ape! Ah, I was just kidding! And with that, King Shake of Fist's curse was lifted.
much personal space? Oh, our bill. Ah! Too bad about Joel. Those potato skins looked good. Don't worry. We got plenty of recycled potluck mystery meal. And there's no one I'd rather share it with. <laughs> jungle where predator and prey live side by side where graceful birds glide through the air and sweet honey flows like rain <sighs> I don't ever want to forget moments like these I've got to start my photo album photo album hmm, sounds unnatural it's important how else are future generations going to see how we looked right now if we don't document it with pictures uh... Like I said. Mm. <laughs> Smile! <laughs> Stop! I don't want anyone looking at me when I don't know it. What if they make fun of my fur, or my teeth, or my... Toes? Uh, now generations will laugh at my toes. This probably wasn't the smartest place to hide. Oh, good, a wacky picture. George, get in there with Ape. <laughs> One moment. <laughs> George, whatever you've done to your hair is great. Oh, George, you do look handsome. Uh, handsome? <gasps> hey, Bear, give me back my camera. <laughs> my memories. I didn't even get a picture of all of us together. <laughs> oh, we'll do jungle pictures instead. It's a little different, but it'll work. Okay, listen up, people. We are going to meet later at my treehouse for a group jungle picture. And if you don't show up, I will hunt you down and tie you to a tree. It'll be fun. Uh, George will try to stay handsome. So, how do you take a jungle picture? A drawing? A carving? Okay, first you have to keep your mouth closed. <laughs> this is what a mud impression looks like when it's done. We'll just pull it off when... Oh! A pimple! A pimple! Daddy! You think George is handsome? <laughs> well, compared to everyone else around here. Hmm. I like the hair, but... You do need to work on your posture, diction, and your knees. My... my knees? Yeah, they point in too much. Still, I suppose he's handsome enough to hang out with us. is handsome! Tucky, tucky. So handsome with that new hair. <laughs> How about I bring you some of my homemade mud pies later? Uh, thanks. She makes the best mud pies. Wonder why I get one. George, everybody treats handsome people better. Watch. Ahem. <laughs> um, I think I'll have. A... Can I help you, gentlemen? Ooh, pretty feathers. Big whoop. Wow! George didn't realize being handsome was so important. <laughs> Here's another one on the house, Mr. King of the Jungle, sir. 
he's the king of the jungle? Why didn't we know that? Ooh, brainstorm. Tell me, George, do you like being handsome? It feels great! I wish everyone were handsome. Yes, exactly! Call the others. Meet at the Cave of Mirrors. <laughs> <clears throat> your attention, please. Hey, I'm over here. Can you take your face out of the mirror for one second? Oh. Our time has come. Soon, we will rid the jungle of the uglies once and for all. With the Jungle King in our tiny uh, but beautiful claws, the jungle will once again be beautiful. Beautiful! Beautiful! Uh, Daddy! Uh, off to find elusive helium berry. Be back later? We have two doctors, and they're both gone, and there are people in this jungle getting pimples. Magnolia? Is my pimple gone? <laughs> George is almost finished. Are you sure this looks like a door to a beauty salon? It, uh, it goes around the whole jungle. Well, uh, this way we won't see the animals getting their improvements. Mm, right. So it would be so much a big surprise when they come back. Boy, being handsome must make you smart, too. Yes! Yeah. 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 Ah! Sorry, I came in to get this bee sting off my face for the... <sighs> picture. Just stay away from the medicine cabinet. <laughs> Get your handsome haircuts and bands right on the other side! Wow, being handsome is, is hard work. How did you get to be king looking like that? <laughs> Put this on. The salon sent it as an early beauty treatment. Oh, uh, we don't see a beauty salon out here. Oh, yeah, it's behind a couple of trees. <laughs> Maybe you should go on the ugly side and show them. Right! Uh, wait. Ugly side? Now! <laughs> hmm. Uh, fellas? George? Yeah! <laughs> What's this huge wall doing here? Well, George thought he was building a big door to a beauty salon so all the animals could go get handsome like us. Oh, uh, George and the peacocks, us. Not, uh, not us, us. Excuse me? See, if the animals are handsome like George, the jungle would be friendlier. I'm not feeling so friendly right now. Did you ever think that maybe those peacocks were tricking you because they wanted the jungle all to themselves? No, but maybe I should have when they put the bag on my head. Well, what do we do now? George is going to get back jungle for all us ugly people. Ugly people? Oh, yeah. Tookie Tookie, lift George over that wall. He's gonna blow! Before. George didn't want to mess up his hair. Uh. Hmm. George has an idea. Hey there, handsome. Uh. Yeah. Ha. Uh, my hair. 
look who's handsome next. Ah, my plume. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening to us? <laughs> my perfect perfection. You, what about me? I was the good looking one. You wish. <laughs> 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 Okay, everybody ready? We're finally going to do this. Hit it, Shep. Oh. Yeah. 